What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today we have a special one because we're going to the top rated parks in Austin, Texas. The first park we're going to is Butler Metro Park. I don't think I've ever been to this park. Maybe I did, who knows? Uh, but we're gonna check it out. I'm gonna be biking there on my Zizzo Forte, of course. The Valiant Steed. I forgot to mention that I designed and 3D printed out this holder for my horn and pepper spray. So everything fits in snug and tight and won't fall off. Anyways, let's get started. Here's my sunglasses. So Butler Metro Park is about nine miles away. We'll be there in 40 minutes. But I'm thinking maybe I want to stop at Lowe's. Oh snap. And uh pick up pick up some repair stuff for my my mirror. I might do it. I don't know. Maybe. My bike feels a little bumpy. So I may have to put some more air in my tires. Because it feels a little bouncy right now. Also, the temperature's been going up and down. Like right now, it's like 75. And that's pretty warm compared to what it, what it uh, what it used to be. All right, I'm gonna take a little pit stop. I'm gonna check my pressure on my tires. Grab this of my custom pack I made. Let's just go to the side. Let's check the pressure. Oh, we are way low. We're like 30. We'll get that up to 40, at least 45. It's actually pretty hot right now, or it's getting hot. So I'm gonna try to make this trip really quick. So this is the air pump I showed you guys in my bike EDC. So we're gonna actually use it, pump up our tires to like 45, 40. Uh, way better. See that? 40. That's good enough for me. All right, let's check the back. Uh, it's a little short. Let's pump it up a little bit more. My hands got dirty, and that's why I keep a towel on me. All right, let us continue. There goes Lowe's over there. I'm not about to cross. I'm already behind. You know, the leaves are starting to change to yellow, but it's so crazy how green it is here still. I'm from Indiana, so I think around this time it would be like orange and a beautiful orange and a yellow colors and red, but it's still green over here. The color green gives me life and energy. So yeah. Plus I'm going to Indiana soon, so I'm still gonna catch those Halloween and spooky vibes over there. Morning. We have this cool little public garden over here. All right, we're about like three hours, no, three miles away. Pretty close. I know this area. So next time you see me, we're gonna be at the park. I just went through a bunch of bugs and I ate every single one of them. Oh, this is pretty cool. Got a little spiral up this mound. Let's get this. All 
All right, so the first impression of this park, it's very nice, peaceful. You got the playgrounds to the right, you got the nice little field, and then you got the long center on the left. You also get this nice cityscape from up top of this mound. You probably can see it from down in the park too. Very nice. All right, so we made over to the park. I feel like this park is really good for families, lounging with friends, picnicking. Pretty nice. It's right next to this event center over here. I forgot the name. I'll put it on the screen. But yeah, it's pretty chill. You got It's not super big, but you do got a lot of space to do a lot of activities. All right, next up, we're going to Zilker Park. Good thing is, Zilker Park is only six minutes away. It's like 1.9 miles. So, should be there pretty quick. You probably just walk over, really. The part two parts become one. So that's the mound I was just on. This over here is the downtown uh, river thing. Don't know the name of it, but it's right across the street. So if you want to come over here, you can also come over here. Especially after 18. Oh, yeah. I just came up my secret entrance, but it's closed off and nobody's in the park. Oh, I wonder what's happening. It's closed off though. They used to have like little leagues or like frisbee and rugby there. It was a really nice big field, nice little park, but hopefully they're just watering it, maintaining the park. Can't show you that one, but we're gonna head over to Peas, Peas Park. I think I've showed you a little bit of Peas Park before, but we're gonna head over there and then we're gonna call it a trip. But so far, it's been pretty fun. It's the weekend, so a lot of people are out right now. Um, but nevertheless, it's good vibes, good vibes. Everybody's just outside getting healthy. So let's head over to Peas Park. So far, this has held up to my test. It's pretty tight, so I don't think it's gonna fall off unless I do a backflip or something. Found this little park with hills. I'm about to do a side mission and ride some. We made it to Peas Park. Looks like there's stuff going on here as well. Let's check it. Okay, so if you come here, you never want to park on this side. You want to take a left and go up the hill and park there. There's more parking spaces up there. Well, we made it to Peas Park. Let me show you as much as I can. Let me show you this dog park thing going on. Looks like a little doggy event. They love their dogs here. It's crazy. I think it's only like a little half, only half of the park, so we should be able to get to the other side. So that's the dog event over here. This is one I wanted to show you. Let's go up there.
they got that little main entrance bit where you can have events, have your kids play on the playground. They have restrooms. They have that dome. There's also another part of it if you keep on following the path. And I'm going to take you guys there now. This is the place where you should park. All right, so this is the park that you can just relax, chill out. There's a lot of shaded area, so you can have a little picnic. And it's more low-key. So, it's a totally different vibe. But it's nice. I would say this park stretches out for like a mile or two. So, it's a pretty big park. The Zilker Park is the, the biggest one. So, I'm surprised that was closed down. Usually, you see people just having fun with their friends. And a bunch of teams playing all types of sports. So that's a cool little community area. I think it's, that's it for this journey. I'm gonna head back to Mikasa. Thank you guys for riding with me today. Hope you guys have a great day. Adios.